John Bennett with Logic Pro X, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to customize the transport bar in Logic Pro X. In Logic Pro X, the transport bar is up here at the top, instead of the bottom. I actually have grown to like it a lot better, but you know, a lot of the times, you know, I, I really don't like the default transport bar that when you open a brand new project. So, what I would do in this case is just click here, and you can. I found to just go to custom that way you can pick the things you want in that area so go ahead and hit custom and it gives you some things here which is okay but if you right click up in this area you can customize the control bar and display usually here I'll check them all on so you can see everything and then I'll show you what I typically will do it's kind of overkill I don't need to see all this stuff so I just right click customized control bar and display usually I don't need to load meters I'm running a really beast machine so I really don't care uh, MIDI activity I don't use that much I uh, will keep very speed on don't need the locators positions time and I like the time and beats so I can see how how the actual time of the project it's one of the things I do need I don't really use the locators so let's take a look now right so now up top I look at the time a lot because uh, a lot of times my project has to be certain certain time so that's helpful for me various speed is is something I use uh, quite often and I'm actually going to show you how to do that in a different video um, and then of course you got your BPM up top and your time the division I will use for fine edits, I'll, I'll change it to 32 so I get a, a tighter edit and then I go back up to 16 so it snaps correctly. When you do this, when you customize this, it kind of bumps some of these icons off the screen. It gives you a little arrow here and you can toggle these. Okay, turn very speed on, off, click, replace, etc. So that's how you customize your transport bar to get it the way you want it. Hope you enjoyed. See you in the next video.